held every year on September 30th, Every Child Matters Orange Shirt Day, is an event in honor of Phyllis Webstad, a young girl from the Dog Creek Reserve in British Columbia, who had her shiny new orange shirt stolen from her on her first day in Canada's residential school system. Referred to as the crying month, September still invokes the painful memories of those children forcibly removed from loving families and communities. More than 150,000 children attended Indian residential schools. They suffered unspeakable harm at the hands of those in charge. My mother was the, the first, well, the many of the first uh, groups that entered. At that time, there wasn't that many um, restrictions. Uh, they were able to go to school for five days and then go home on weekends. The second generation for my family was when my sister, my oldest sister, entered into residential school. But by that time, the laws had been implemented, so they had to stay in residential school for a period of uh, 10 months out of the year. And it was two months was the time that uh, they would go back home and connect with uh, family members and connect with parents. But there was definitely a separation during that time, that 10 month period. The University of Manitoba College of Nursing Faculty of Education and Nursing Student Association have been holding an Orange Shirt Day walk annually since 2015. Over 200 faculty, staff and students take part each year, walking from the Helen Glass Center for Nursing to the National Center for Truth and Reconciliation. I'm so very proud to be an Indigenous uh, nursing student at the University of Manitoba. Mm -hmm. Just to carry on our knowledge of the residential school system, uh, teaching, bringing up, being, bringing awareness. Uh, I feel as a nurse that you're constantly teaching and, and learning at the same time, um, whether that's with your patients, whether that's with your colleagues, instructors. Each year at the end of the walk, the nursing students renew their pledge to practice culturally safe nursing care in partnership with the Indigenous people and their families. On behalf of the future nurses currently studying in schools, colleges and faculties of nursing in Canada, the CNSA commits to support health promotion and culturally safe delivery of health care in partnership with Indigenous peoples. We commit to recognizing the distinct cultural identities of Indigenous peoples and celebrating their contributions to society. Along with the pledge by the U of M NSA, we recognize the injustices Indigenous peoples have experienced due to the impact of harmful policies implemented by the federal government and the church. These have left a legacy of pain that has negative repercussions still today. We also recognize the resiliency of Indigenous peoples as they overcome past atrocities and reclaim their cultural identities. We acknowledge that we can learn from their worldviews and healing traditions. We commit to being positive role models that engage Indigenous individuals, families and communities in culturally relevant health promotion and health care services. In honour of Phyllis Webstead, we will remember the children, those who returned and those who never made it home.